Hello, welcome to this course on Mastering Solidity Basics. In this course, I want to teach you all you need to master the basics of Solidity so that you can start building your um, blockchain application. You see, a blockchain application has uh, the back end, which is just about the entire thing of the blockchain, and then the front end that interacts with it. So, in the scope of this course, one I want to walk you through all the steps that you take to successfully launch a you know a profitable back end on a blockchain network okay so you're gonna learn everything you don't have to worry at all we'll start with the simplest of thing which is uh, the interface of uh, Remix Editor. Remix is an online editor developed by Ethereum Foundation to help you develop smart contracts on the Ethereum network. So it has Solidity installed, it works with your browser seamlessly and I'm go just going to introduce you to the interface of it and on the next video we'll start using it to develop our smart contract. So if you're pumped as I am, let's get started. All right, so whenever you open up a Solidity um, environment by visiting remix.ethereum.org, you'll be landed on this view. This is how it will normally show. And with this, you know that your Remix ID is loaded on your browser. So at the leftmost part of the, uh, of the ID are the tabs, different kinds of tabs, uh, a tab for, for file or file explorer which includes your directory your working directory on the browser where you have your smart contract your scripts that you want to write your test and all that you know but most of the time we just spend our time in this contract folder so and if you want to create a new file in solidity code a new smart contract this is where you put all of it inside this place you can see these are my previous um previous smart contract that i've developed so it's there right there in that interface um so this is uh the search interface which allows you to search for keywords that all throughout the projects that you've created in this id so it will search every smart contract that you've created and spot out wherever the keyword is found like for example let me just say a pay to and then click enter it search throughout all my smart contract like you can see this particular smart contract called amagidon p2e you know you can see where it is found there and when i click on it it literally opens up in the browser and you can see where it targets it so that is how the search interface works the search tab this other one is called the compiler tab all right the compiler tab has list of uh compilers that have been released so far by uh uh, solid for solidity by ethereum of course so it, it, it all started with um uh, with a version of 0.1.1 and as of today as of the time of making this recording we have version 0.8.15 okay but the one, most stable one that we use is version uh 0.8.7 which is the one that is here so we use that to compile the smart contract into you know a byte code uh, a, a machine executable code the type that your machine can really understand you know that your machine doesn't speak uh, a human language so we do we speak the high level language and your machine speaks the low level language all right so for your machine to understand your smart contract a compilation process has to take place which what we translate the code that we've written in high level language to low level language it's just basic computer science <laughs> all right so now here is a deployment tab where we send our smart contract to the web and we can test it out you know uh, we have different um, environment you know we have VM London which is an Ethereum virtual machine you know they just are given the name London and we have VM VM Berlin okay we have other kinds which is injected provider for example Metamax we have hard hard provider Ganache Foundry and all that you will need most of this. You will just need this London or this Berlin. That is just what you will need for this particular build. 
all right and this is uh, about 15 accounts that are given to you on each one of those um network uh the evms that the test evms that, that are provided for us virtual machine ethereum virtual machine that is what evm means so what you need uh, you, you can use any one of these accounts as listed like this to test out your smart contract each one of them are loaded are preloaded with 100 ethers that is the native ethereum currency 100 ethers test ethers for testing out your smart contract they are not real ethers so don't try to use it on the on the remarket or think about that either so um here we have gas limits you will see much of this use later on but i just want to show you this is where we do our deployments and this is debugging tab this is a settings tab you can set add new plugins i mean this is a plugin tab you can add new plugin or disable activate or deactivate uh, a plugin this is uh, a settings tab where you can change some critical settings like for example you can change the theming of your of your uh, remix editor when you initially load it is going to be white or light but you can change it to dark mode like you can see mine is in dark mode here so because i actually did change it myself all right fantastic I could close this particular um part now when you open up this particular smart uh, contract folder then you see a list of contracts you can actually let me delete this old, this one you can actually create a contract by just right clicking you right click on the tab and then you'll be able to what, create a new file let's say call this demo.soul soul is the extension for a solidity file and then this place is where you write all your codes inside of here all right and here below down below here is where the console where all the activities will be taking place whatever you do will take place here for example i'm going to go ahead and compile this particular smart contract that i've written in the past so right now when i come to this tab i will compile this test you can see that when i compile that it goes ahead and perform the compilation you see it went successfully now i can come i can come to this particular tab and deploy it as of now you can see that th there is nothing here so when i just click on this deploy button it shows up here you know to show me the information about the deployment all the transaction data this is just how a blockchain application works under the hood but i just want to show you the different parts of a smart of uh of the remix id how it works and everything and whenever you finish deploying you can always see the smart contract that you've deployed here at the bottom left corner which contains all the functions and everything you created you don't need to be overwhelmed by all of these things that i just finished saying because i'm going to teach you how to code from scratch you, you understand that how to do this thing from scratch and get it well you understand because you need to understand how to code this smart contract it's really important if you're going to really get that you know web trade job that you're thinking about so that is for it for this particular uh, video on the next one i'm going to proceed in showing you the structure of a smart contract and start diving into the code all right then have a great time <laughs>